Hello guys and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 Game of Thrones as the Beesbury's. We're playing as Lord Nicol of Honeyhold and uh, we are finally able to change the focus. Now, I did go forward just a couple of months, like maybe three or four months. Um, because, well, it's kind of difficult to do stuff if you're a slothful character and shy. Um, it's difficult to do things, but I'm now finally able to change my focus from scholarship, which I really should not have had anyways. And um, I'm going to change it to hunting because, you know, we are we're an incompetent commander, so kind of the martial area would fit. Um, also, we're, well, we're slothful, so we, we don't really have a lot of hobbies. But one of them I could kind of think about is, like, maybe go hunting. The other one would be carousing, yet I'm not sure if that only means drink and glutton only means food, basically. So... This is why I think hunting would fit, because we can do it alone, uh, in the in the woods, we're alone basically, or we can be. Um, we're gonna, we can eat the stuff, and uh, we can sell whatever's left, uh, or not sell it, but give it out to the poor, or something like that, whatever. So I thought this would probably be the best out of all of them, so yeah, let's pick hunting, and uh, let's go fast forward. The Reach, uh, we have a new... Uh, Lord Paramount. We have Lord Paramount Mervyn Florent after his father died a natural death. Um, he's now ruling the Reach and he joined the war against the Stormlands. Um, and yeah, this war will be won uh, very soon. Right now the uh, Reach armies are kind of fighting some uh, Ironborn raiders. Jesus. Now the Tallies are actually finishing them off. But these guys are really ridiculously annoying. I don't even want to be Lord Paramount of the Reach. This is just terribly annoying. But oh well. Um, so yeah, we have this guy, he's 10 years old, a skilled fighter, squire, uh, a little bit shy, envious, and diligent. And now Princess Senris is now riding Caraxes, 14 year old attractive lady. Ooh, attractive Targaryen. And she is riding Caraxes. Wow, he's... What the fuck? What is a 14 year old girl doing with, a s with this dragon? He's amazing. Oh well, anyway. We still don't have a son, but our wife is pregnant. And there we are. Here it is. His name is Lucas Beesbury, but obviously we're gonna change that to Jackson Beesbury. So there he is. Uh, he doesn't have any genetical traits, unfortunately. Um, and uh, we have fulfilled ambition to have a son. Now, I don't know if we actually have anything else. Gain an army title, I wouldn't know why. Up well, become a high lord, I don't think so. Have five children? No. Uh, fall in love? I don't think, to be honest, as a slothful person, we don't have any ambitions. <laughs> I think we're just, we're just, ha we're not content, but we're still just fine with whatever we've got. Um, look at this, we're making way more money. Did we, uh, did we lose the Scorched Earth modifier? I think we did. We still have offended moneylenders, which is going to be here for another six years. Um, incompetent ruler, offended moneylenders, yeah, and smuggler's ring, obviously, but still, I mean, we have household guard drilling in here, not over here, somehow, uh, why is this not capital yet, I'm sure I've changed it, oh, primary title and capital is something diff, I see, do we have to establish a household guard again, come on, that's bullshit, that's, that's bullshit. <sighs> fine. Uh, what's this guy doing? He wants to buy someone's loyalty? Fine, I don't care. Um, and my half-brother wants a thief of his own. Um, well, I'm lazy. I'm charitable. I would give out stuff, probably, I think. Not necessarily holdings. Perhaps. Um, I'm slothful. Shockingly lazy. Um, I don't know. Like, I personally, as a character, I don't I don't want to give out a title. Especially not if I have the domain size to, to keep it. Um, I don't know. But I, I guess so. Would I give out a title? I'm charitable. And I don't want to have these castles. Well, I just don't really care, I guess. Hmm. I don't know. I wouldn't 
I wouldn't do that. Promise to arrange it. I think, okay, I think let's do this. Uh, let's just say I promise to arrange it because I don't give a shit. Let's, let's do that. Alright, let's do that. I, I think we're gonna do that. Let's see what happens. Uh, I don't want to give up the title just yet. Even though it might be roleplay-wise the correct thing to do, but, nah. I don't know. Okay, so we can go on a grand hunt. Now, unfortunately, actually, what is the summer fair? Um, all sorts of entertainment to your province. No, we don't want entertainment. Uh, I guess I want to establish a house with God again. It just sucks. It just really sucks. Um, you know, this is annoying. If you, if you make your title, I made this my primary title. I thought this also changed the capital. Apparently, it did not. Uh, it, it, it didn't, and now I know. But that is very annoying. Um, I have to say. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, I like having household gods. Uh, Lothar Shadigan is no longer participant of the war. As uh, okay, whatever. Yeah, I don't give a crap. There's more wars going on. Why would I care? We still have household god drilling here. It's still a household god. This is this is odd. I just want to keep that for now. Um, yes, thank you. For some reason, this guy, the uh, master Pinto of this province, is always helping out the king in his wars. It's interesting. The Westerlands are fighting. They're fighting the Iron Throne. The Jure War over Pain Hall. The Veil and the Throne against... Oh, but yeah. King Jokeris is winning. And our Septon reports that Master Emin of Dersbury has been humbled by your endless generosity. Ah, oh, isn't that awesome? What's this? Given a seat in the Council of the Most Devoe. Okay. Anara Wentwater. What is she doing? Kill Illyria Valerion. I don't care. Do what you please. Do as you please. And Dale is no longer married. Mm, ignored confessor's advice. Okay. I have minimized the amount of work I need to do each day by delegating most of my workload onto my couriers. That's awesome. Good job. Everyone hates you. Wow. But I, I like that. <laughs> I like working less. It's a good thing. Um... We still have the captain of the household god, do we not? No, we don't. All right, we need it. We need a household god. I don't know. We, you just need a household god, do you not? I guess I just don't care. No, I no. I need a house. I'm sorry. I need a household god. Great. Give me a household god. And make somebody uh, captain. Oh, Dale is already a captain. Um, command the guard. Uh, type of drill the soldiers. So you should get household guard drilling now. Yes, they have. And now this province lost it. Okay, I guess that's fine. We're finally making money. Three bucks. That's pretty good. Even though we're a terrible steward. But our state stewardship is not bad. Our spouse and our counselors. 21 is from... Okay, I see. Um, 16. So basically, it's just a uh, 16 state diplomacy. That is the justice, sir. Okay. Um, yeah, whatever. You're doing your wars. I don't care. Um, Marshall is the counselor, who's 13. Okay. And s stewardship, we get something from our spouse, but only half of it, and it is rounded down. I feel spirited and restless. Maybe some work might calm me down. Oh, I'm no longer lazy. That's interesting. That's certainly helpful uh, because it was kind of boring doing nothing all the time. But yeah, finally I can do something. I can pick an ambition now, I think. Um, do I want to become Master Arms? No, but perhaps become a higher lord? Become exalted amongst men? Um... Castellan of his liege. I think becoming Castellan would be a cool thing. But probably I have more luck becoming Master Arms. So let's try become Master Arms. Um, incompetent commander anyway, so yeah. 
Anyway, um, what was the last one? Uh, right, Intrigue. We also get something from our spouse, only half of it. And Learning, we also get. So Learning, Intrigue, and Stewardship we get from our spouse. Okay. Counselor is 11. Right, that's our... Uh, and Learning is also Counselor. The Septon. So Maester doesn't give any stats. And uh, neither does the Castellan. And I think we are done pacifying the province. We can actually oversee this uh, to get some more money out of Honeyhold. I should change our tax. Not significantly. But your spymaster Septon Horus has sent you a gift. It is a small puppy, but of the finest pedigree and is destined to grow into a great hunting dog. Will I accept this gift? Um, I, I see no reason not to. Pay someone to quietly dispose of it. No. No, that... Oh, I could eat it, but no. I will accept the gift. I, I think there is... I think I'll just accept the gift, yeah. And how do I name him? Um, Tricky, Hunter, or Faithful? I, I think just Hunter. I think. I'm not that creative, to be honest. Alright, so my wife is Chast. But she already... Gave us one son, Jackson Beesbury. Hold on. We can imprison people, so what is it you're doing? I'm no longer sloth, so at least end your plot. That's fine by me. Uh, end your plot. Don't want anyone to go around and kill people. Don't need that. Our piety is still dropping like a stone. Our prestige is going up, though. That's good. Did my son inherit a tyrannical stain? He did not. Good. My half-brother Abelard reminded me of my promise to grant him a fiefdom. Um, I guess. I mean, yeah, I, I'm charitable. I, I, I guess I give him a, a fief. Um, I, I don't see why I refuse him. Other than I personally don't want to give out a castle, but... Yeah, I, I think. Yeah. You get uplands. There you go. Yep. And uh, our maester. Now we lost our treasurer. That is that is a big problem. You know, we lost our two best treasurers. Him and his wife, basically. He has uh, 18 and she has 21. So that's really unfortunate. Um, and my niece. So yeah, and we also lost our castellan. So we need a new one. Um, let's first pick a treasurer. She's the best. She wants to become treasurer. Okay. Let's pick her then. She's a brilliant steward. And collect taxes. And the Castellan, we're gonna appoint uh, Master Garland. He's also a brilliant steward. And he wants to become treasurer. Everyone wants to become treasurer. Stop it. But. Or Garment Hightower? No. He, yeah. Pick him. And uh, oversee the province. I, I really hate doing this. But I feel like. It's kind of necessary, but what we're going to do, we're going to, um, we want to improve relations with him. Yes, we do. Let's send our, uh, dude to improve relations with our ally, because he is our ally, right? Good, and his heir is Deanna, so we might be able to intermarry to get this back. Don't know. So yeah, we are no longer gaining that much money. Oh, still, we're still like, making a lot of money. Interesting, it seems like we're all, almost making more money than we have before. Um, okay, these messages are kind of annoying. So yeah, he has now to deal with our uh, smuggler's ring, uh, so that's good. And Roger Wentwater and Annette have, have a genius kid, Dale. So yeah, this guy is attractive and a formidable fighter. This guy is nothing else. She's genius. The first daughter was nothing, but she, he is a genius. Cool. We might get the genius trait into our family if possible. But the Wentwaters so far have been rather useful. Oh, we lost a couple of people. The new bodyguard. Um, so yeah, we're going to pick Alice Black by now because she is the strongest fighter we have. Petrola, my wife, is also not bad. She's a trained fighter, but she is strong and a skilled fighter. Look at this. Dual skill of 10. Yes. I wonder why uh, a woman uh, has a thingy. But still. So. Woman as a bodyguard is still alright. Uh, Septon, you will be the high almoner. 
because I've always done that. That's like a tradition uh, for the Beast Breeze. We need a Master of Hunt. Um, someone with Marshal. This guy's our commander. Master Arms. Captain of the Household Guard. He is a duelist. Slothful, though. Uh, he's a commander as well. Make my commander... Make him Master of Hunt. Sure. And uh, Master of Horse will be another guy of Sir Torrance Edgerton. Uh, yep. Sure, why not? My Master Arms. No. I think Lyman will be. Yeah. Alright, Lyman. You enjoy. There you go. Continue. And the Lords of Uplands approved a change. Okay, I don't care. I honestly don't. She's probably a treasurer. No, he made a justice. Why would you make a justice, sir? Are you stupid? What an idiot. But he's going hunting just like I am. How is he the castellan of Old Town and not me? Fucking hell. He took on my freaking half brother. To serve in old time, not not me. Fuck you, Lionel. Anyway, your dog is growing quickly and is no longer a little puppy. Good dog. Ah, oh, lovely dog. Yeah, we're making now significantly less money. Yep, I expected that. I mean, we had to give up a castle after all. But really, I saw no reason not to give it up. I actually, I saw the reason to give it up. Oh well. And my mom is still alive. She's now no longer. She's not married. Can I invite her to court? Yes! Alright, um... Living reinforcement? Yeah, let's just invite my mom to court. I mean, why not? She's my mother, after all. So there she is. Hello, mom! How are you doing? She's a cruel woman, authoritative, and rough. Um, but just shy as we are. Just and humble. Cool. So how are you doing, mama? Look, my half-sister, Margaret Marbrand. She's married to House Brum. Do you want to come to my court? Mm, no. Okay. Oh, she's not an adult yet. I see. But anyway, still, we're making decent money. I'll just go and fast forward here. And what is going on in the realm anyway? There's constant wars. Who are we fighting at the moment? Uh, Strong Sun, Sunrise Keep, and Bloody Gate still fighting. And uh, King Jacarys is winning. And the throne and the veil against the rock, and he's winning as well. He has 20,000 men under his command. That's amazing. The Reach is basically doing nothing. Actually, no, he's... that's not true. Okay, he's helping. Who else is helping? Um, the Reach, the Riverlands. Those are two big little paramounts. And my wife is pregnant again, even though she's chest. I'm very happy about that. Very happy. So there we have Jackson. He's doing quite well. Who's Desmond? He's my cupbearer. Okay. I always need to check on all these people I have. Emin, what is he? He's my castellan of uplands. Yeah, no longer interesting to me. Um, my my brother, my half brother on the wall. He's still just a courtier. Still have Lord Commander Mark the Mad, who's now blind from age. Ooh. And Lord Paramount Rickon has declared the Northern War for Maelor's claim. Interesting. For Maelor's claim. Who is Maelor? This is Maelor. Master Arms of Bloodstone. He has a dragon egg. Oh my god, all these dragons! Every single- every one of the claimants uh, has a dragon. Look at this. Except for this guy. But yeah, he already lost. He was maimed. He was an idiot. He had a dragon. Okay, so you are fighting the north. You have 20,000 men. How many men does the north bring? 17,000 only. He's a poor military ruler, rallying support. And he wants to see his house on the Iron Throne. He has a claim on New Gift. How did he get a claim on New Gift? It's part of the Night's Watch. And look at this. This is part of Summerfield. Isn't that awesome? House Trant beyond the wall. 
Oh, and we can uh, educate our half brother Edwin. And we're gonna make him a commander, I think. Uh, no, who has high learning? Yeah, the Septon has the highest learning of them all. So we're gonna make, we're gonna do that. We can give him an education, it seems like. Yeah, he, he doesn't have any education yet. We, we, we're probably able to choose at some point, but... Interesting. We're gonna make him a commander. We need good commanders, that's for certain. Oh, actually, no. He did get a martial education. Poor, who did it? Oh, his mother decided. Interesting. He's now envious. He was... What was the other one? Kind? I don't know. Um... Right, Strong Son has been defeated. So now it's just the Westerlands and the North. The Reach obviously joined against the Westerlands. Yeah, it should be rather easy to fight these guys. Jacari's armies, 5,000 men. Perhaps he doesn't have 20,000. He might be in trouble. I wonder. I just like that the North has twins. My young wife has taken a passion for romantic poetry. She keeps reading any sort of romantic poetry she can get a hold of. Um, get her some more to read. That is her interest, not mine. These books are created by demons. I don't think these books are created by demons, but, you know, I'm charitable. I like to give things out, but again, you know, no. I don't know, as a charitable person, charitable person, I would spend money, especially on, like, my wife. Um, on the other thing, though, I don't know. Gain piety. Okay, lose, she loses fertility. Um, or she gains fertility and gains the lustful trait. I don't know, this is a tough decision because it's her interest, not mine, that's, that's true, but... No, I think charity. I'm. I like charity. Is that is that charity? I'm not kind. Ah, uh, I'm shy. You know what? I think that's just her interest, not mine. I don't think I'll. I'll give her that. Sorry, wifey, but no books for you. At least none that I have to pay for. These guys are just raiding the far winds. How many men can raise? 2,000. A little bit more than that. A son was born. Nicole. Uh, do I want to name my son Nicole? I guess. Alright, fine. Who's fighting over here? Hitch has now come of age. Um, Golden Grove and the North March. Lord Kenther. Cool. Um, Hitch is of legal age. He's a mastermind scholar, even though he got a steward education. How's that possible? How is that possible? That doesn't make sense. Oh well, uh, you're gonna marry. You're gonna marry, uh, Sela. Yeah. Sure, why not? You're 16. Uh, she has good stuff, traits. You can marry my mother, but that's not gonna happen. You can marry Valerion. She's ill, but she wants to marry. Interesting. Don't know. I don't wanna marry you just now, but... I still wonder how he got a Mastermind Scholar. Oh well. Uh, oh, we need our Septon to perform some charity. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. Definitely do that. And our Master Arms, do we want him to, ed to train our children? He probably should. We want to have strong children. Lady Patrola. She's not lustful, right, because I chose the other thing. Ronald Cockshaw. He's the heir to Bard's home. He wants to marry. 
Um, you can marry my mother. Um, Sabrina. Nah. She's just, she has good stat. Uh, her, her traits are good. They're all green. Anyway, what's this? Um, I've discovered a plot. Lime and Beesbury seeks to kill. What? Lord Nicole of Honeyhold. Are you kidding me? My master of horse and my. I cannot believe. And he he got the best out of, out of all of them. Well, that's gonna make things easy. Um, you will be imprisoned. Enjoy. Actually, no, 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 no. You. I want some more arrest, arrest chance. Now imprison him. 60%. He has fled. Damn it. I hate that. So I need, now need a, need a new bodyguard. His wife is still here. Hopefully he just fucking dies. I hate that kid. What? Mm. What a shit kid. Oh well. Well, we're gonna make my wife my bodyguard. No, that's stupid. We're gonna make this lady my bodyguard. Simply because. And we need a new master of horse. And that should probably be... Uh, master of arms. Cap the house of guard. Just a certain uh, regent. Uh, commandant bodyguard. Yep, him. He's a dragon. He can hunt. Damn it, Lyman. Curse you. Ah. Uh, can go into hiding. Who's protecting? Who's who's doing this? He's the only one. Well, I think I'm gonna go for a grand hunt. I'll try to find the white stack. Let's see what we can do. We like food. I could build. I could build some buildings here. I think I will though. Uh, the sight hounds thirsted for blood this gentle afternoon. They brought out many hares. Good. Can we uh, find the white stag, please? Oh, the war has ended in the white piece. Come on. Probably Mago died. While chasing an agile deer, my horse stumbled and broke his leg. Luckily, I was thrown off, but now my horse is in pain. I will end his suffering myself. The Grand Hunter's over. Well, that was it? That sucked. Fucking hell. That was a bad hunt. Nothing happened. They want to kill Sabrina Mendeley. Alright. She's Tom's daughter. More raiders. Castle of Fung Tower. I can press that claim for my mom. I can declare one the rock for my mama. I'd love to do that. I'm a firstborn, right? Um, that would be awesome, but uh, I don't think I can fight this guy. Yeah, he has 4,000 men. I got 2,000. I'm uh, not even 2,000. 1,000. And what is he plotting? Replace Horus as a spy master. End your plot, please. Interesting. Um, yeah, I don't think I'll do that, though. Uh, right, he's suppressing revolt, so I'll, I'll change him to chain, uh, train the children. And he stopped his plot. Good job. Too bad this guy hates me. Oh, I refused him as a de designated regent. That's why. I could claim for my mom, but there's no... We're not lunatic. There's no point to the Kyle War. Something we can not win. Even with a dragon. It wouldn't really make sense. Having Fang Tao over there, it just... It doesn't make sense having that castle. To be quite honest. But yeah, anyways, guys, I think I'll be uh, putting an end to this episode here. Oh, one more guy who can uh, imprison. Nah, no, just end your plot. Anyways, uh, I'll put an end to this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Sufranka, signing off.